What's up allies in today's news video we're going to be talking about a new humble bundle deal we're going to be talking about a new mcu update that should fix the trigger issues that some of you guys might be having we're going to be talking about the allies support in external eGPU and also we're going to be talking about asus actually offering refunds for people who have broken sd cards or rg allies so if that's something you guys were interested in hit the like button subscribe to this channel let's get right into this video so first the news they seem to be be a new MCU 312 update that fixed the trigger issues that some of you guys might be having on your RG Ally. Now we've done some videos showcasing this issue. It happened a lot with Ratchet and Clank. So let us know if this update fixed your issue in the comments below. But some people they're actually saying that this update actually is causing some issues for them as well. So go into this one with caution. So next we have a new humble bundle deal. This one titled Humble Masterful Modern 3D Platformer Bundle. It's a mouthful. But with this, you get a hat in time, you get a hat in time, seal the DLC, you get hell pie, you get the spirit and the mouse, you get K of the kangaroo, demon turf, K of the kangaroo, Ben the rules DLC, new super lucky's tail, pumpkin jack, demon turf, and another K of the kangaroo DLC. So if you like K of the kangaroo, this one is definitely for you. So for those of you guys who are wanting an XG Mobile but are hard in catch and cannot afford it, some people are working on a mod that should let you be able to use external GPUs on the RG Ally. So I'm posting the link in the description so you guys can see this as well. But as you can see in here, this states that we're working on a new adapter board designed for the RG Ally eGPU kit. This kit is going to allow the Ally to work with all Oculink eGPUs. This is great news. So if you guys do have this eGPU, definitely stay tuned to this project. I'm excited about this for sure because as you guys know, the XG Mobiles are hard to find right now in stores. So if you can use an external GPU that's not an XG Mobile, I'm all in. So there's an email that went out by Aces claiming that they are actually going to be refunding people who had uh, SD card issues with RG Ally. They're going to be refunding the amount that you paid for your SD card. And they're also going to be refunding RG Allies too that have been damaged by this issue. So this is the letter right here. And again, I'm posted it here so you guys can actually read this. But yeah, so if you guys have had issues with SD card, if your RG Ally have fried your SD card, definitely hit up the contact here. And it seems like they should be able to refund the money that you use to purchase your SD card. But not only that, it seems like they also will be refunding your RG Ally. So yeah, this is good news. And it's good to see Aces definitely taking responsibilities for this one. So last the news, it looks like we are getting FSR 3 and it looks like this is actually going to support the RG Ally. Now this is really exciting as you can see here, it is going to bring a significant FPS increase to the RG Ally. As you can see here with Forspoken, it's actually bringing the FPS up to 175, which is absolutely nuts compared to 53. And these are the future games that are going to support it. As we know with FSR 2, the list started small, but eventually it grew. And then future newer release games actually started supporting this. So this is really cool. And then it does make this device future proof, knowing that the newer AAA games are going to be supporting FSR 3. So this is awesome. Can't wait to test this out myself. But let me know in the comments below. You guys are excited about FSR 3. Appreciate you guys. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Until next time, later allies.